Welcome back to the Discord server creation series. Today, we will be going over how you can invite people to your server once you have roles all set up and all that stuff. So, there are a few ways to do this. If you want to create a, ro a, um, a invite to a channel, just hover over the channel if you're on desktop and click the plus button here that says create invite. Oh, I got sidetracked there. And then, or, like, if you want to make an invite so it drops people right into the rules channel, click here, and then here you can, you, you can, um, invite people directly to the rules channel. But if you want to just create a regular invite, click on your server name, then click on invite people. And then here you can find a list of people in your friends list. So if they're in your friends list, they might want to invite more of your elevators. I'll just type in more of your elevators. Click the green invite button, and and then I go to go to his account. And I click join, and see he is now in the server. So that is how you create invite links. Now let's go over how to make the links longer or shorter. Oop, I do not want server settings. Revoking invites is the last thing we're going to go over. You can let it you can make it expire after 30 minutes, an hour, 6 hours, 12 hours or one day or infinite links. If you're going to make an infinite link, make sure that if you can do one day and no limit for one day. If you do never, it is strongly recommended that you set a limit for the amount of invites you can use. Like, if you choose to make an, um, an infinite link, make it so that way it will expire right after 25 uses only. And then after you, um, that's just my recommendation. If you grant a temporary membership, they are automatically kicked when they disconnect or if they, um, or unless a role gets assigned to them. Once you have your link setter settings, like, like, if, or you can, um, I'm gonna go with a six hour link, but if you ever go with an infinite link, make sure that you let it expire after a certain amount, of, make sure you let it expire after a certain amount of uses for troll reasons. I'm not gonna get into that in this video, but, yeah. But in the meantime, you're gonna click on generate a new link. And here's a new link you can copy. You can find all your friends in your friends list again. And then just click the invite button if you want to invite that person. Like if I wanted to invite TAF, I just click invite, which I'm not going to invite him though. But that's how you do that um, or create links on your server. Now, regarding invites, the last thing what you're going to want to do, if you want to ever revoke an invite for whatever reason, click on your server name. You have to have Manage Server in order to do this. And then go to Invites. And then as you can see, here are some invite links that I have created. So to, to remove an invite, there are a few ways to do it. One, you can either... If you're on mobile, click on the link that you want to use, and then click Revoke. If you're on desktop, all you have to do is click the X. And there you go, those three invites are gone. Anyway, I hope this little video helped you guys out. If you have any questions or concerns about this, let me know down in the comments below. I'll re respond as soon as I read them, and we'll go from there. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks.